Sorry about that, everybody. Um, Stephen is the tech support wizard here. He uh, he knows all about the the, um, the internet exploration and the um, all of that uh, that IP address stuff. I don't know a lot about it. I'm, I'm, I'm religion is my thing. You know, we know a lot about Jesus and and saving people. <laughs> Fuck, 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 But not only that, uh, our Bible also comes uh, with a 100% guarantee, uh, and that is to get you into heaven. If you purchase it, you will go into heaven. You will be granted into the circle of life, and that's a guarantee uh, or, your, or your money back. Okay, did, did that occur to you that that is fucking retarded? I'm not good with women. They hate me. I'm short, kind of heavy, not the greatest looker. I get one, and then she's banging a bunch of black dudes. Jeffrey, um... Fucking anti-homosexual detox bullshit. Jeffrey, um, I'm just gonna... Hold on one second. I want to take this call off the air. Um, I, um, I, I am sorry, Jeffrey. I was reaching across to answer uh, my text messages, so I didn't hear the last part of your message. Um, but I've, 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 I've took the channel down, um, so I've muted it. It's just you and I. Jeffrey, have you been drinking? Just bourbon. Bourbon. Jeff, Jeffrey, the first thing that you need to do is to put down the bottle. But then how are girls going to find me pretty? Jeffrey, it's not your fault that your wife slept with multiple black men. It's not your fault. You need to stop blaming yourself. It's your fault. Jeffrey. Filling her all full of dad's cream. Sending her on her way all ungayified. Jeffrey, your, when your wife came to our homo detox clinic, she, she had a lust for women, okay? And as you know, God has to come first. God has to come first. And you cannot get into heaven being a homosexual or a lesbian. You know that, Jeffrey. But if God comes first, when do I come? I want to come, damn it. Jeffrey, you, you will never come before God. God always comes first. You need to know that that's the Christian way. From Stephen, is this in your portfolio? Mm -hmm. I guess your old portfolio. Okay. Well, I'll just roll the clip. I don't know what this is. Um, I don't, okay, so here's a clip from uh, Stephen's stand-in roll here. We'll just, we'll just play it. Scared. Come on, Mindy, honey. Be a big girl now. There's nothing to be afraid of. Is it gonna hurt bad? Oh, child. Only for a second, sugar. A handgun bullet travels at more than 700 miles an hour. 700 miles an hour. So at close range like this, the force is gonna take you off your feet for sure, but it's really no more painful than a punch in the chest. I hate getting punched in the chest. You're gonna be fine, baby doll. <laughs> And there's, um, and that was, uh, I don't, Stephen, I'll be honest, I don't really approve with the content of that uh, film, but that was, that was a while ago. I actually, um, back in the early 2000s, um, I, I, this was before your clip, Stephen, I think. This was, this was a couple years prior um, to some of my stand-in work that I've uh, worked on. You may recognize this film. A wizard is never late, Frodo Baggins. Nor is he early, 
He arrives precisely when he means to. <laughs> it's wonderful to see you, Gandalf. And that's, um, that was a small clip um, from my, a lot of the front shots aren't used. As you notice, that is actually uh, Elijah Wood in the movie. Um, but for the, the shots of the back. Oh, shit, baby. Was that Dad's cream? It, it, indeed it was, Randall. Yes. I, I, gotta, I gotta admit, I know what Dad's cream tastes like, but I think it's a different consistency um, from what you're used to. Yeah, are, you, are you referring perhaps to the old stock? Yeah, well, yeah, it, it is a little bit older than me, yes. Right, baby. Oh, just a second, I have a question from Richard. Asking about oh. his Firefox, is the man looking at me? Okay, do you have Firefox, Randall? Um, I'm actually using Firecox um, 9.0. It's, it's much, much bigger. Okay. And it's a lot faster. Um, you know, when, when I use Firecox, I find that, that the plugin feature is pretty orgasmic. What do you think? Is he... Hang on, I'm going to turn it down. Is he, putting, is he putting me on? Excuse me? I don't think so. Hello, anybody? He's using Firefox. Oh, okay. Yeah, Firefox, Pardon, pardon me. I, I, with your accent? Yeah, I thought I just, you said something different. Anyways, is, at the top of your screen, is there a man looking at Richard? I installed Firefox today a few times, but I'm looking above. I don't see a man yet there because oh. I know this is a religious channel, no F sharps and stuff. When I pulled my penis out and I had an explosive um, orgasm, it didn't hit my boyfriend's back at all. Do you, do you follow me? Can you picture this? Sir, I don't think you understand what type of channel this is. It's a religious oh, I, I channel get, I where religious the, people the religion come yet. to talk about religion, not filth, gays, homo it's sapiens, not. or anything else like that. I'm getting to the religion, baby. Calm down. My God, you got an erection just sitting there. Okay, go on. I'm going to just okay. loosen my tie, though, if, if that's I, okay. I'm getting sweaty listening to Randall Baby Stevens. I can see it. It's, it's just, it's hot in here. That's all. And it's getting hot in here. Baby, take off all your clothes. Oh, my God, it's getting so hot. I'm going to take my clothes off. So I pulled my um, thick penis with a vein in it out, and I, I had a, a, an ejaculation. It was part of love, because that's what two people who do, what they do when, they have, when, they're, when they're in love. They pull their penises out. And the ejaculation, it cleared his back. And, and the sprays actually hit the cross that I had on the wall. I mean, it was splashing Jesus Christ's face. Now, I don't know what that means. I, I, I have no idea. So what does this mean um, to you professionals? Stop. Stop what you're doing. Wash the cross. You need to... Stop being gay, and you need to purchase a neon Bible for 19... What you need to do, Randall, is you need to pay the price. You know that we have a song coming out on YouTube, and it goes, You gotta pay the price, pay the price all day. You got, it goes like that. It's going you know, to be on YouTube. People have paid me to, um, uh, to, to administer fellatio on me. Is that what you mean by pay the price? <laughs> Maybe not. I, I don't know. He's choking. Pardon me, I crunch myself. Don't um, crunch yourself. But you know what I do? I get duct tape, and I put it in the front of my testicles, and then I get the duct tape, duct tape and I, I lift it up towards the back of my legs to my back, and I tape them, and then I wear bikinis and stuff. That is probably the gayest thing I've ever heard. Richard, how about you? I'm sorry, Randall, but we have right now, if you, you may not believe this, but we have 38 calls lined up. And All right, faggot. When you straighten yourself out, I'll give you a call back. Good night. Thanks for nothing. I see Read that. this chat. I'm going to ban him. Get the name, copy and paste the name, and then put ban. Let's just shut it down. Let's, let's, let's want to sing Kumbaya and just shut this down. Okay.